Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today, everyone, I am here with a channel messages reading from your person for all of my Geminis who are watching. So if you have Gemini as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, then this reading may resonate or apply to you. So Gemini, your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation and communication at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart, Gemini, is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and officially begin and get started, please keep in mind that this is and will be a journal reading for your sign, so it may or may not resonate for you here specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. Also, Gemini, if you are interested in viewing your extended reading, which will be the energy that foreshadows this energy from your channel messages reading, feel free to check out the Patreon membership, which will be linked in the description as well as the comments. But let's go ahead and officially get started here, Gemini. Let's see what energy we do have making its way towards Gemini, please. When it comes to love in this person, who is this person and how do they truly feel towards Gemini? One more message for now. All right, so let's go ahead and start with what we have so far here. So first we have, I don't want to block your light. I don't want to block your light. I'm so attracted to you and your energy. We have a future ahead of us. Don't worry about the past. I love you more than you know. Build my trust so I know it's real. You're deserving of more. And I love you, but I refuse to settle. All right, Gemini. So... I do feel like this is someone you already know here and someone that you may have built a strong relationship with, including a friendship with. Um, so it's like getting to know one another as people and admiring this person's presence and they admire your presence in, in each other's lives. So I feel like that means a lot to the both of you here. And on top of that, there could be deeper feelings that you two share for one another here. But I feel like there is this energy of someone not wanting to hold you back or set you back. And for you, Gemini, it's like you want this to be the best it can be. So you may be understanding of delays or there are learning curves that me and you have to get through with or get through together. But we shouldn't. We shouldn't just block out the possibility. So I feel like for you, Gemini, you have been optimistic towards what this connection could be. But it could also be the point of, I love you, but I refuse to settle. I, I can't, I understand you and I care for you, but I can't lower my standards. And also, I, I don't want to lose you as a friend. I don't want you to be just out of my life for good. So I love you, but I refuse to settle. Perhaps this connection did did reach a, a dead end here and you had to stop it or put a cap on it, Gemini. I do apologize for any background noise here. So for some of my Geminis, this may have been the outcome here. There's too much ups and downs. I understand you, I care for you and I get you, but we need to focus on our own selves for the time being. And I feel like this person, they, they do or they did have good intentions. I don't want to block your light. Understanding that you have your own life, Gemini. You have your own things that you want to work towards and accomplish. And 
they they do as well for themselves but being on different timelines or different paths individually I don't want to be a distraction or I don't want to I don't want my actions to come in the middle of our friendship our relationship so I don't want to block your light but then again I'm so attracted to you and your energy not just on the outside Gemini but on the inside as well and this could have been an energy vampire where someone absorbs your energy and makes them feel good and then once they feel fulfilled, then they, they distance themselves, they leave you alone, Gemini, up until the next time. But I feel like this person was self-aware of blocking your light or draining you or coming in the middle of what you have going on for yourself, Gemini. So I feel like this person may have exited or left this connection because you're deserving of more and they felt like they couldn't give you exactly what you needed or deserved gemini so you're deserving of more as always a personal message for you but i feel like this person it's like when you love someone when you care for someone things aren't perfect they'll never be perfect things aren't seamless and you still see the potential, but this person knows that this you don't know the full extent until you're in it, until you're deep in it. And I know what it feels like to be like that, and I don't want to put you through that. So understanding that you're there for them, Gemini, but also not wanting you to hurt or suffer here. So you're deserving of more. Build my trust so I know it's real. I feel like this is a shared component that you and this person both value and that's that's a reason why you two are as close as you are right now or that friendship was well established this person knowing that you're a solid person to them and maybe that you you do a lot for them but that's not your your job gemini so build my trust so i know it's real i love you more than you know a shared energy but from this person's side even your presence the person you've been, you've helped this person more than you know, Gemini, just by being there for them. It has uplifted them. And we have a future ahead of us. Don't worry about the past. So this could be an energy in reference to just the timing of how things grow and evolve, or evolve, excuse me, grow and evolve between the both of you. It's reminding me of like, maybe it's just not our time, but we do have the future. Let's just work towards the future for ourselves. And then you'll always have me type of energy. Like I'll always be there for you. No matter if we're together or not together, you'll always have me. All right. So let's see what else we have going on for Gemini, please. When it comes to this energy. Last but not least here. All right, so we have, I feel like I found myself with you. I don't think I'm right for you. And last but not least here, we can fix this now. I won't wait forever. So we can fix this now. I won't wait forever. I feel like this is your energy, Gemini. And let's go back to, I love you, but I refuse to settle knowing that this could be so much bigger, so much stronger, seeing the potential, but you might be tired of waiting here. And this person knows that, and they don't want you to wait for them here. So we can fix this now. We won't wait forever. Maybe it could have been a mutual thing, like this isn't the timing or this isn't our time. I don't think I write, or excuse me, I don't think I'm right for you. This person's energy here feeling like you could do better or and not do better as an insult but just knowing that you're you're deserving of more gemini i don't think i'm on the same path as you we're all on different paths but i need to catch up for myself and i feel like i found myself with you a shared energy which is why you two grew to be so close putting yourself in this person's shoes and vice versa here but I feel like this person wants to stop things before it's 
too deep or too late or before you get hurt, this person gets hurt. And that love, I feel like it's still shared from afar, no matter the distance here. All right, Gemini, if you are interested in checking out your extended reading, what is yet to come following this energy, the Patreon will be pinned in the comments as far as signs here. Could be dealing with another Gemini. Gemini right there. Sagittarius. Sagittarius's reading will be posted shortly before yours. We have Capricorn, Sagittarius, Gemini, Capricorn, last but not least is Taurus. All right, Gemini. So I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that for today. As always, I do appreciate the love here and the support. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you all next time. Bye.